Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Maddie Moyer, and for those of you who are new, today is a belated Makeup Monday. It's Tuesday. I was so busy this week and I did not get a chance to film for you guys, so here it is. I'm wearing my red because tomorrow, my favorite character, Cheryl Blossom, played by Madeleine Petch, comes back on with Riverdale on The CW. If you don't watch Riverdale, I suggest tuning in. It's pretty freaking awesome. But today, we're gonna do Cheryl Blossom's makeup, which of course is the classic red lip with a light brownish purple eye. Okay, here we go. To create Cheryl's smoky eye, we're gonna use my new palette from Ulta. They're having their super clearance sale or whatever, so if you need makeup and you have an Ulta near you, go check it out. I'm gonna be using this light tan and the darker brown directly next to it to create the smoky eye. And then I'm actually gonna use this light pinkish purple you can see it right there, to highlight. Take that lighter tan shade and sweep it all the way across your lid. Now we're gonna go in with the darker shade and go in the crease of your eye to create the smoky eye. Now we're gonna take that pink purple and go on the apple of your eye and the inner corner and the brow bone. For Cheryl's eye, they keep it pretty natural looking just because she does wear a bright red lip. So we are actually going to then take this darker shade with a little liner brush, if you can see that. Now we're gonna take this liner brush, which is angled. We're gonna take this darker shade at the bottom and our liner brush, and we're gonna just line the top and the outer corner of the eye. We're gonna take that same liner and now do a little on the bottom. Okay, now I'm gonna curl my lashes and do both the top and the bottom. I'm gonna be using Roller Lash by Benefit Cosmetics in the all black. Madeleine Petch has a very um, porcelain complexion and she doesn't really have a lot of freckles. So her foundation um, is full coverage to give her like a clean porcelain face. I do have some freckles, but I'm still gonna use my Renewed Hope in a Jar by Philosophy in the sand color. I'm just gonna do a layer all over my face. To continue with Cheryl's look, we're gonna contour our forehead and our cheekbones. Again, I'm using the e.l.f. palette in this darker shade. Now, Cheryl's face, because it is porcelain, they don't put a lot of blush on her. I'm just gonna do a very light hint of blush 
Again, with my new palette from Ulta, I'm going to actually use this lighter shade and just do a light brush on my cheeks. Now Cheryl is always very glowing, so I'm going to use my Lumi from L'Oreal. It's a palette of all highlighters. It's true match. It comes with a nude, a purple, a blue, and a white. We're going to use this nude highlight and a highlight brush. And I like to go back in and again take that same nude highlighter and go again on the brow bone. Okay, now it's time to do our eyebrows. I know I raved before about the e.l.f. brow pencil, but mine ran out. So while I was at the Ulta sale, I decided I was going to try another new brand to see if I liked it better or worse. So I picked up the NYX Brow and Sculpt. I don't know if you can see that. But this is the Auburn shade, and it comes actually with a sculpt and then a highlight pencil. I'm going to need my brow brush, that way I can shape them. Like I said, it is extremely red. You can actually go back in with this darker shade that you contoured your face with and go back in and put some powder in your brow to make it more brown than the super red. Um, again, I think I still like my e.l.f. pencil better, but it's nice to try new things. Now for the final touch, we're gonna do our lip. So I'm going to line my lips with an Ulta lip liner in the color Rose and then fill in with Revlon's Color Burst Matte Lip Balm in the color 250, which is standout. Remarkable. And there you have it, my Show Blossom makeup tutorial. Again, if you don't watch Riverdale, it comes back on this Wednesday on The CW. Tune in. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Hit like if you liked it that much. Hit subscribe if you want to follow along and comment below what you want to see for next week. And tune in tomorrow for the hair video of the week.